The number of COVID-19 cases is slowly creeping back up as preparations to reopen schools are in full swing. We conducted a special back-to-school Q&A session with Toronto's Associate Medical Officer of Health and she addressed parents' concerns about if or when the decision might be made to shut down schools once again should the case numbers spike. We are keeping close eye on the case counts. They are starting to creep up. I actually just had a meeting today with the Toronto District School Board on this matter to, to start talking about at what point would we maybe say use an adaptive model or go to online learning because the case counts are too high. And so our staff at Toronto Public Health are keeping close eye on those numbers, are reviewing the literature to figure out what might be some threshold to determine that. It won't likely be a specific number. I mean, will it be the number for the, all of the city? Would it be for particular neighbourhoods, particular schools? If they have a couple of cases that they can't look back, it might just be a school issue, might not be a neighbourhood issue. So all of these things are things that we're keeping a close eye on so that we can provide that guidance. It's also based on our surveillance. Surveillance means we're keeping a close eye on the numbers, who's getting the cases, where are the cases, what are the characteristics of the cases to be able to inform uh, public health measures. And deciding on a public health measure like closing a school is definitely in the purview of what Toronto Public Health would be doing. In our Back to School special, Dr. Vinita Dubé also addressed parents' concerns about class sizes and enforcing safety protocols in school. For the full chat, you can go to our websites, citynews.ca and 680 news.com. Point your phone camera to the code on the screen you see right now and a link will pop up to take you directly to that article. For City News, I'm Dilshad Berman.